Hi, this is Melanie Geralds for Bassity Beat, and I'm here in downtown Mount Clemens where you can now enjoy wireless Wi-Fi internet services at all the local businesses. The current service in place, uh, we're brand new. We've been just started down here as of January 1. Um, I cannot speak to the particulars of the old service, but uh, uh, we offer many different packages. We've been around for about a year and a half offering Wi-Fi. Uh, Beaver Island is one of our first starts, and then south of Lansing is another one. This is kind of our first claim to fame in doing a large-scale municipality. Uh, currently, we got about a quarter mile coverage. The downtown area between Gratiot and northbound, um, we're pretty much the main street up and down, and then through the central corridors. There's uh, six radios that are up, kind of spreading signal. We might have some bleed over some different areas. We're going to work over towards the, the waterway uh, towards summer and uh, kind of expand accordingly. Basically, this is Mount Clemens Wi-Fi system. And we want the business community to be involved in it and to tell us where to take this technology, uh, what's going to benefit your businesses, uh, how, how do we need to grow this network, and so forth. And of course, Central Solutions, which is represented today. The Art Center, being a nonprofit, cannot afford to spend a lot of money for any of the extras that we need. And so I, I can see that a partnership with a company like this, um, maybe they would be able to publicize our offerings more, having our logo on the, the landing page, so to speak, or just by, you know, partnering with the other businesses that are supporting this, I think we can get a lot more exposure. I'm hoping to find ways to uh, have the customers come back to my business, especially with the court district in our uh, city. It would be great to find ways to get them to know about our business at lunchtime and dinner to come back. The attraction for me is allow people to basically get on the internet anywhere. You know, you're not limited by cords and you can move around freely. I would hope it makes people come downtown and hang out for a while rather than just come downtown for one specific reason and then leave. If they know that they can access Wi-Fi easily and relatively inexpensively, they might be inclined to spend an afternoon or even a day downtown, and that's going to be going to make them more likely to visit more businesses and the art center. The goal is actually to expand out, and we're going to tear out as quickly as possible, as quickly as demand is. Um, if we have a flood of residents in the downtown area that say they would want service that's now and they come out, we will actually look at that and it'll build accordingly. So it'll basically be built upon the service and the people and the needs that are driving it behind it. I think the coverage, um, the coverage is going to improve as the businesses sign up for it. Um, the tiered approach, uh, we want to be involved with the business people. We want them to have access and buy into the system. As they buy into the system, they become repeater points, and so the signal kind of regenerates itself and it gets stronger, and uh, thus allows more bandwidth to go through. We're also working with several different providers to provide more bandwidth into the area. Um, we have a single source, and uh, single source internet providing is never a good way because if we lose our main feed, then everybody's down. So we're working on multiple paths to get it out of Macomb County. That's uh, pretty much getting trained on it and getting knowledge of it because I'm not too familiar with computers, and she's going to have a hands-on training today with me, so that's going to be very helpful and useful. My major concern is making it affordable to all of us because all of us downtown, I think there are very few businesses that are doing really, really well, and so I hope that the services are affordable and meet our needs. Of course, there's always a security concern with internet, but another kind of related concern, the problems that the library had recently with people hanging around and accessing iffy websites. You know, I, I don't want to see people sitting downtown in the coffee shop or sitting in the art center and accessing something that, you know, I, I don't want my kids to be, like, to walk by and see their laptop, so those sorts of concerns. You can visit MacombWiFi.net. It gives you general information about the service. And then from there, if you're down in the city of Mount Clemens, it'll be Mount Clemens Wireless. It'll show up on your little beacon on the bottom of your wireless access point. Sign on, and then you'll get a redirect, and you'll find out more about the service. Or if you just want to learn more about, go to MacombWiFi.net. Next time you're in downtown Mount Clemens, make sure you bring a laptop to take advantage of these new internet services. And be sure to use the internet to search some of the great local businesses. For Bass City Beat, I'm Melanie Geralds.